This airplane is based after the VMB 612 group. This airplane was refurbished by a man named Ozzie Parrish, and he was with the VMB 612 group. They had gone on 22 missions. In those 22 missions, she had downed three merchant ships and one Imperial ship. Went out on her 23rd mission and never came back. So when they were able to restore this airplane, they based it after the VMB 612 number three ship, and they also put the nose art on. They didn't get to have nose art when they flew in the Pacific because at night the moon would reflect their location. They were in Iwo Jima and Okinawa. They did a lot of islands in the Pacific and they would go out at night, first airplane to have radar, and they would go out at night and find the ships and down the ships at night. They could carry 4,000 pounds of bombs and they carried rockets and could carry one torpedo. So they were pretty powerful and pretty, pretty successful in their missions. And they learned early on that you can't drop bombs on a moving target from 8,000 feet. So the Marines learned to skip bomb, and they would come 20 feet off the water right at those ships, pull up and skip the bombs into the ships. The fire protection they had in the front nose of a bombardier nose was only one 50 caliber machine gun. So the crew started slapping on 50 caliber machine guns and the engineers from North American found out, went out in the field and said, wait, wait a minute, let us uh, design a gunner nose for you. 